Time now 602 the day after Hurricane Milton hit our area. It became the scene of the largest water rescue in our region. That's right and nearly 500 people trapped at the standard at 2690 apartments on Drew Street in Clearwater mm -hmm. and now tenants are told they have about 12 hours to move out. 10 Tampa Bay's Eric Glasser joins us live this morning there and Eric people say they weren't given much notice to begin with and now in most cases many of them don't really have many places to go. Yeah, good morning, guys. And, and those who do have some place to go say at this point, they're just running out of money. The apartment complex, they say, gave them just a few days notice that they needed to pack up their belongings and get out. Many of the buildings, they said, had been deemed unsafe. And now we're told that some of those buildings will likely have to even be demolished. It has been an emotional roller coaster, as you can imagine, for the folks who live out here. We spoke with them. They tell us it has been heartbreaking, nerve wracking frustrating as you can imagine you'll remember that this apartment complex as you said was the scene of some of the most dramatic water rescues the day after milton struck our area residents tell us that they were trying to work with the apartment complex maybe get into a unit that wasn't so badly damaged instead they say that they received notice that they have to be out by 5 p.m today and many say they have already spent their money on hotels food and replacing what belongings they have left it's just really sad, you know, there's a lot of people that are suffering right now and they said, oh, we'll be here and help you do anything, anything at all, whatever you need, and they haven't done anything. We did reach out to the apartment complex management, Infinity BH, for comment, but we still have not heard back from them. Although given the damage that they did sustain, you'd have to wonder really what alternatives they do have. We're told that some residents have resorted now to living in their cars and staying in retail complexes in this neighborhood. There is an effort underway. Some community organizations, charities, and local faith-based leaders are trying to pull together to help the folks that were living here as they move out. But clearly with that 5 p.m. deadline looming, time is running out quickly. Reporting live in Clearwater, Eric Glasser. 10 Tampa Bay. Thank you, Erica.